All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the next episode of the campaign for Battlefield 1. I'll let you guys take a minute to read all this. Most replacement pilots have experience of less than 10 hours. The average lifetime of an RFC combat pilot is 17 days. Is that what that said? Wow. Wow. I have nothing left to bet, you idiot. The plane. <laughs> That's rich. <laughs> oh, why the hell not? I've got you beaten anyway. Oh, yeah. What have you got? Hmm? <laughs> Wipe your mouth, Blackburn. That wasn't supposed to happen. But you know, I'll be taking that plane anyway. What the bloody hell? You lost, I beat you. Mm. The thing is, Rackham, it's a very beautiful aeroplane and you're kind of a jackass. I beat you fair and square, goddammit. Stay the hell away from my kind. Oh. Oh, you bastard. You can't do this to me, I beat you. I beat you. My name's Clyde Blackburn. I'm a pilot and a gambler. I'm George Rackham. I'm George Bloody Rock and listen to me! You bastard! Keep off my aeroplane! If you asked me to name my biggest fault, I'd have to tell you. I'm just not a very honest person. <laughs> Welcome to Friends in High Places. Welcome aboard! I'm Wilson, by the way. You must be George Rackham. Sure, I'm Rackham. I'm your guy. Let's get this kite up in the air. You're George Rackham, son of the 4th Earl of Windsor. That's right. Hip, hip, go, me. The Bristol was everything it was advertised to be. A pure joy to fly. It was a crisp, sunny day, and everything would have been perfect had I only been alone. Gotta follow this plane, apparently. Oh, gosh. Now let's get a feel for the yoke. Stay close on his tail. This is difficult. Holy crap! Ugh. Oh, 
Lower the throttle and stay on him. I'm working on it. There we go. Where's the other balloon at? Oh, there it is. Bam! Done. You see those targets on the ground? Yeah, I see them. Try using the rockets on them. Get a feel for hitting the ground targets. Okay. Ah, uh, okay, I see what we gotta do. Okay, there's that one. Let's come back this way. Circle back around like this. Here we go. And... Uh... Okay, we'll come back again. Rockets were almost out. Circle back around like this. Oh, and then here's this one up here. Can we hit this one from down here? Oh, okay, nailed it. The last one. So, can I ask a question? Sure. Why does George Rackham, son of the fourth Earl of Windsor, sound like an American? I think a back sense easily. Probably be speaking French by the time we got the Jerry's beat. I see. You're a very suspicious man, Wilson. Has anyone ever told you that? Jesus Christ! Germans! What do we do? What do you think? We shoot them down! Oh boy. Destroy all enemy fighters. Oh! Okay, here we go. Easy, easy. Come on. Oh, I just ripped that dude's tail off. Come on. Easy, easy, easy. Come on. Come, there we go. Easy, easy. I don't know, you can repair on a plane. That's freaking pretty sick. Whoa, okay, circle back around. This is kind of difficult with a mouse and keyboard. I may have to swap to a controller to do this one. Ooh. Okay, I'm working on it. Come on. Oh. That was too close for comfort. You can say that again. Whoa.
Oh no. I can't repair. There we go. That was scary. Makes me wonder. Hang on to your knickers. Nope, we can't. I was gonna try to use my. Oh, I can use the uh, the controller. Okay, here we go. Let's try this now. Let's try this and see if this is a little easier using the controller instead of the keyboard. Woo! There we go. Much better. Controller is much easier than a mouse and keyboard. <laughs> now we're talking. There we go. Oh, right there. Stay on him, stay on him. There we go, another one down. I'm working on it, I'm working on it. Oh, he crashed into the mountain. Whoa! <laughs> oh, is there still another one? Yes, there is. Definitely much better with a controller on flying. Much better. What are you doing? We should turn back! Ah, uh, to hell with base! discovered where Germans were keeping their munitions for half the Western Front. And Wilson's pictures would help HQ launch a major assault. There was just one problem. I'm not sure about this. Oh, come on. We did a great thing. We'll get medals for this. We weren't even supposed to be there. When the commander sees these pictures, he won't care. We did a great thing. We can do it again. I'll make you a deal. If we pile up on this, then you need to promise me that you'll get me back in one piece. Sure thing. Promise. I need your word. Okay, I promise. Stay here. And don't cause any trouble. You know, I did like the guy. But he was kind of naive. Sir, you might want to take a look at these. Saints alive, your man must be one, one hell of a path. <laughs> Before we knew it, we were back in the air. Our mission? To clear the way for the bombers so they could blow that fortress all to hell. First, we'd have to down the barrage blimps. Jesus, imagine being a lookout on a blimp. Bad luck, Fritz. Next, we'd have to deal with our anti-aircraft trucks. The assault was already in full swing when we got there. 
We'd have to deal with all those defenses, then escort our bombers to their target when they arrived. Tall order. But victory here could change the course of the whole damn war, they said. Safe to say, Wilson was less than thrilled. Now we're actually doing this, it feels really dangerous. Trust me. And buckle yourself in, maybe. <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, we're going to wrap this episode up here. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time.